What's up everyone, Shoot here and welcome to another Clash of Kings video. Well guys, today I'm here to talk to you about the new position system and the possi possibility you have to appointing heroes in, in several tasks uh, in the way you can buff various aspects of your, of your game. In this case you can see in the, this panel we have several tasks and for each task you can assign or, or appoint heroes to increase the buffs and today i will talk to you about exclusively ex sorry exclusively about the heroes and the way they can increase the buffs the stats uh, on your castle uh, in next videos i will talk you about equipment i will talk to you about uh, talent but right now let's talk about the best hero for each task and let's start and for order if you open the hero position, you have uh, Governor, as you can see. And in Governor, uh, it's all about the castle stats. You have uh, Troop Load, you have Marching Speed, Rally, Forging, Turret, and the uh, upper limit of Marching Troops. And this is very important, because the only hero that can increase your, your march is Selma. Uh, no no other hero can do this so selma uh, if you set her talent in military you can increase the march limit and you can increase your global march and this is very important so it's the reason i choose selma for the task of of governor of course she she could uh, have um place in military uh, options but in this case uh, the the march is very important in construction officer uh, you have uh, you have the if you choose the with the launch of civilizations if you choose yamato you know you have or you you already have the hero kamatsuhim and kamatsuhim it's uh, all about uh, construction uh, buffs so as you can see have active skill rapid construction small architecture massive architecture and sp exclusive skill the building consumption so if you started with Yamato it's the best option for this task and with the right talent it's a, a good help in terms of of the general construction of the the buildings and it's a very very cool choice in my case i choose yamato so I'll, i already have komatsu him and it's my best choice for construction in resources officer we have a hero that clash of kings launched a, a few months ago it's joseph and joseph it's it was a free hero they launched they launched it with a, a pack one dollar pack to to get the hero and I think it was a way of, of getting a, a reward to the, the players they like together and not about the war aspect of the game. And it's a cool hero in, in, in terms of resources. Uh, have exclusive skill, the troop load and the marching speed. Uh, and the active skill, it's about the, the, the resources and the way you gather the, them uh, and the possibility to... to train automatically train assault cards for for gathering so it's a, a cool choice and almost everyone already have joseph so place it here in research schooler it's all about research in the college uh, increased stats uh, you have the conception resources for for research and uh, as always as i said in in the construction you have the dragonborn hero uh, that is all about research. It's Caroline and Caroline starts with active skill, urgent research, burst of energy in, and excellent material and ex exclusive skill, the science research. So um, if you have, if you choose Dragonborn, you probably already have Caroline and you can have a special buff in, in terms of research um, general research it's a, a cool hero too uh, they are not powerful uh, 
uh, in terms of, of uh, in general, but they have that exclusivity that it's very, very cool. Here we have doctor desk where you can increase your hospital cap capacity, healing speed and the recovery speed. And once again, doctor, it was featured in the castle. Now it's exclusive. And for hospital, you have Valkyr, the um, hero from the Vikings. It's a very cool hero. Uh, you want to, to change civilization to unlock this hero. It's very, very important. And if you unlock Valkyr, if you play with Vikings, as you can see, exclusive skill uh, increase the, the hospital capacity and have the, the active skills about uh, that too. If you, you are not playing in Vikings, um, you really ha have to manage the way of changing and then lock this, this hero and then change again because it's really, really cool. About the recruitment officer, you have one of the oldest heroes, the Clash of Kings launch, that I think it was the, the second one after Bernard, and it's, it's Jared, and Jared, it's all about training. You can really increase all the stats uh, in the training aspect, the exclusive skill of the hero is the training amount and the training speed and the active skill it's all related to, to training uh, for me Jared is one of the, the most crucial heroes here in this system because now tra training troops it's a key aspect as well as the doctor um, and uh, the last one I will show you and with Jared, you will really increase your buff. If, if you set the talent right and, and the right equipment, it's a really valuable uh, hero. And for last, we have Guardian Knight. And the Guardian Knight is very cool because it's the same as Garrison the Wall. And here you can increase your buffs related to military defense. And... Uh, as I said in the in, in the beginnings, uh, Selma was a good option, but because I want Selma increasing my march, I placed Bernard. Bernard is not it's the oldest hero, is not the, the best choice in terms of, of skill, natural skill for the task. But excluding the heroes I had left and uh, the options I for that exist for now, Bernard is still valuable if you set the right talent and if you set the 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 right equipment uh, he make the job done so it's my choice for guardian knight defending the castle and one of the the the, the crucial aspect for last we have rufus rough rufus i did not assign him it's a backup hero that i placed in in several positions supporting uh, what I need and it's it's not important for me it's not a good hero I don't really like him but he can support another another slot and for last we have Christina Christina is it's for me uh, by far the, the best hero uh, because I like war so this is a hero to send to war and she's always free to to uh, to set my march and she can be second choice in any of the tasks but i want her always free one of the very very important things i want to talk to you about it's the 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 new possibility of the your heroes gaining experience by being appointed. Every time you appoint a hero in one task, uh, her or, 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 or him receive experience every hour. So it's a very, very cool feature because now there are so many heroes and if you are not spending money, it's a way to, to keep them upgrading uh, as slowly as can be. It's always a help and it's a very, very cool, good feature and I really enjoy it. And this is it guys, in the next videos I will focus more on talent and equipment, but for now this is the general picture, I hope uh, you guys like it, and leave your comments, this is my view, but if you have another perspective, I, I really appreciate your, your opinion and your comments, so feel free to, 
to share your view about this and I really hope this was helpful and a good guide for you. Well guys, see you in the next video and bye. Thank you for watching. If you like my videos, please subscribe my channel and follow me in my other social media. Facebook, Twitter and Instagram. Slash shootin up. See you next time.